Hi, welcome to Chemexel Technologies YouTube channel. I hope you guys are safe during this pandemic situation. And in this video, we'll be seeing how to stream with inbuilt hardware of Ada Mini Pro and Ada Mini Pro ISO. So both Ada Mini Pro and Ada Mini Pro ISO, the workflow is completely same. It has the same ethernet, but for Ada Mini, you don't have the inbuilt streaming hardware. But for Mini Pro and Mini Pro ISO, it's completely the same. Okay, so let's say I'm going to connect my USB-C. You know that USB-C directly connected to the computer, you can stream right away. But for example, if you want to record the content at, and as well as stream, that's where this streaming inbuilt comes in. Okay, so let's say I'm going to connect my SSD to the device. And as you know, you can see the green light and which is ready for recording. And you can see the streaming, we don't have any kind of information here. So to that, to do that, we need to give internet connection to the Adam Mini Pro ISO. So right now I have a Mac in front of me and I will be going through that. And you can see that over here. I'll also be showing you the final screen. So let me shift to my first input. This is my Mac interface and I'm connecting my Ethernet cable. I have an Ethernet cable and I'm just going to connect directly to my Atom Mini Pro ISO. And right now there is nothing. You don't see any kind of information, but you will be seeing an yellow color light in the Atom Mini Pro ISO. But still, I am not sharing any kind of internet to the Atom Mini Pro. I have my Wi-Fi connected to this laptop. I am going to my system preference and I am going to find my sharing. And you can see internet sharing. Don't just enable inter internet sharing because we need to enter Thunderbolt Ethernet. So we are taking our internet connection via the Thunderbolt Ethernet. So I am just going to hit Thunderbolt Ethernet and I am going to enable sharing and I am going to just start. I am going to Adam setup. You can see my Atom Mini Pro right over here and if you select your software control, you should able to automatically log into Atom software control. And in the software control, in the right side, you have output which one goes for live stream and another for record stream. So recording, we are through USB-C right now. This is our recording stream and you can see your file, you can change your file name for example, uh, demo. And you can see the drive which is connected, which is our SSD and you can hit record and it will record all the content. Enable status which will come around the bottom. You can see the da uh, data of the recording. You can start recording and it will automatically record. You can see the record function here as well. So I'll stop this as now and I'm going to go to my streaming. So as of now, we have three things in build, which is Facebook, Twitch and YouTube. So let's say I'm going to stream through YouTube and my service is primary and we need to enter the key and I'm going to my Safari here. I'm going to just right click and go live and it should automatically take me to the live page. If it is connected through USB, it will automatically detect your Blackmagic design. Since we are using USB for recording, we are going through this method and I'm going to stream and some basic stuff you can add this you can name your stream title and th stuff and here you have your key you have your stream key right here you can just copy this and you need to paste it over here in the key area and you can select your streaming setup so which is streaming uh, medium which is 4.5 mbps streaming low 3.0 uh, mbps and you can also hit display status you can see your what kind of information that you are sharing. So I can simply hit on air through this or you can simply hit on air over here and it is going to automatically go on air and you can see my signal right in our YouTube page which is we are streaming right from our Atom hardware and you can switch between the sources and check your live stream. We are streaming through our ethernet connector and we are using our USB hard drive for recording and you can see we are on air and you can come here and hit record. You are recording the content as well as streaming the content. So that's quite simple and 
a powerful feature in Air Mini Pro and ISO where you can record and you can stream all at the same time and you can choose what kind of quality that you need to stream that's pretty great so you can stop it right from here you can just hit stop and off that's quite simple and easy and you can also use your software control panel to stop and start so that is all about streaming right in the hardware from Ada Mini Pro and Ada Mini Pro ISO if you have any doubts just put on the comments I will try to replay as soon as possible and thank you for watching